just straight up, I'm not even bullshitting. It's like, there's no one I know right now besides Brandon who actually has made money in fitness and knows how to do it. I'm, I'm, that's the straight up truth. Yeah. How do you price or know what to price your service? your offer? Let me ask you the first question. I think whatever coaches make you the most money, you should just like give them double. So guys, here's here's the number one thing I found with business coaches. So there's a lot of business coaches who do seven figures a year, but guess what they do? They do business coaching. They don't do fucking fitness, they do business. So my first five coaches, they're like, yeah, I do seven figures a year, da da da. I'm like, you make seven figures a year off guys like me who yeah. don't know what the fuck they're doing in fitness. Never did it. Like that so, one, the guys that you guys support, I don't think no. he was ever really a trainer. I, I don't, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, and Brand, and Brand knows, I've had discussions with him. So it's like, there's no offense to people, but how many of you know a guru, right? I'm not gonna name names, but how many of you know someone who's made a lot of money off books? That's like all you really know they've done, like his books. A lot of times they're not rich because of what they're telling you to do, they're rich because they sold a damn book. Just straight up, I'm not even bullshitting. It's like, there's no one I know right now besides Brandon who actually has made money in fitness and knows how to do it. I'm, I'm, that's the straight up truth. If you don't want to spend, you know, sixty thousand uh, dollars and learn the hard way, I really suggest like you find someone who's done what you want to do, and then they teach it. So if they're like, "Hey, I'm going to teach you how to make seven figures," be like, "Well, have you made seven figures doing that?" And if they say, "Oh, uh, well, no," it's like, mm, "Okay." I know a lot of guys in fitness who switched to business coaching because they couldn't really make it in fitness. I just haven't met anyone besides Brandon who actually is making money in fitness who knows the business side. Now there's guys who are making a lot of money, but they're just content creators, right? If you have 5 million followers, you can just immediately start paying someone who's like, yeah, I'll do your back end for a percentage. That's different. Does that answer your question yeah. though? And then what was your other, how to know when to spend it on coaches, like when to stop? Uh, that, but also the second one was how to know like what to value your, your coaching at. So, Price. yeah, so look, if you're starting to close a lot of deals, a uh, uh, close rate for, I'd say an average salesman is 30%. That's very average. Okay. My close rate's around 70%, but I got a damn good system and I did door-to-door -door sales. If you want to get really good at sales, go do door-to-door. -door. I know that sucks, but it's like, that there's nothing harder you can do. So what I do is very simple, is I'll start playing with the price. You can also do, you can also lower the price. So, you know, I start at 25 and when I start closing a bunch of deals, I'm like, shit, everyone's buying this. So let's bump it up. I'm like, let's try three grand. I mean, that's one of the Everyone, reasons, like, I'm sorry. I mean, you're, no, you're good. Like people are saying, I put the price on the fucking website. I'm like, no. Hell no, ne tell you guys, don't put never, price never tell website. someone the price. That's the other thing. Never, ever, 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 ever tell someone the price. You tell someone the price before you get on the phone and you say they're not going to buy anyways. So there's no point. It will never happen. You just say, oh, well, the price depends on what you need. What, what, what does that mean? Well, well, have you ever bought a car before? Yeah. Well, well it depends on what you need. I tell them, well, listen, we're getting way with the show. I hate ourselves. I don't even know how to fit. <laughs> yeah, that too. <laughs> that too. Yeah. So you, you don't tell the price, but to answer your question, it's just you keep playing. And then what I started doing is what I do now is this. This is how I close. I say, so look, I'm a pretty busy guy. The business is growing. So to work with me one-to-one, -one, it's 4800 That's the expensive option. Now, here's a deal. Because you took time to get on the phone with me and do all this process, like usually it's just 4,800, but for you, what I'm gonna do is as long as you can do a minimum deposit. Here's another thing. Never get off the fucking phone without a deposit. If they, if they don't do it, they're not coming back. Get that out of your head. I It, it, it just drives me nuts when someone goes, they said they're gonna call me back. No, they're not. They're not gonna call you. Cause that's like a girl who doesn't give you her number and says she's gonna find you next week. No, nah. she's not. Thanks, <laughs> so. dude.